Would you believe me if I said it has been five, five, five months since my last dedicated Amazon haul video? I need products that I am loving, tried and true, not just picked up and might never touch again. So since it has been five months and we are halfway into the year, I thought I would round up my favorite Amazon products so far in 2021. You already read the title to this video, so you know I am rounding up all of my favorite Amazon home products that were under $20. If you love Amazon as much as I do, or just love going down a rabbit hole of Amazon videos like this, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I won't keep you any longer. Let's get into my favorite items. First item is a handheld milk frother. If you're on TikTok, I'm sure you have one of these. These were all over the place, especially when that whipped, what was it? It was whipped coffee. When whipped coffee was really popular, like that was a huge trend during quarantine. So I don't purchase coffee anymore from Honeydew, Dunkin', Starbucks, unless I get a gift card. I make coffee at home because I am such a fan of the cold foam. This is a staple when I am making my hot coffee. I absolutely love frothing up my almond and oat milk. You have definitely seen me use this in vlogs. I love it. Since everyone was really confined to their home for the last year, year and a half, I think we all did a lot of home improvement projects or just organizing. So I think of myself as a very organized individual, but there's always room for improvement. So I picked up this hanger to better hang my belts. I just kind of hung them all on one before, like right on the little hook and it wasn't working out. It was taking up so much space. All of my belts are easily accessible and there's more room in my closet. I used to hate that I have to take all of the belts off of one hanger to get to the one belt that was at the bottom. It was so annoying. So for $6.99, this made my life a lot easier when getting ready. As you can imagine in my filming room slash office, I have a ton of wires. I have my desktop, my laptop, my lighting. There are just cords everywhere coming out of every direction. So I picked up this, it's called an outlet extender. Um, it's more like an outlet cluster. So each outlet block has six plugs on it and it cleaned up my space so much. I also keep one behind our bed because we have lamps and phone chargers and diffusers. So there are just wires everywhere. And at least with this, everything is in one place, unlike an extension cord where everything is just kind of spread out, especially in my office. You can see the wires everywhere. The other thing I did, which I'm mentioning it because you can see it in this clip, is I bought this wire holding box. I believe I've spoken about this in another Amazon video, but this cleaned up the space so much too. It's neat, it's white, it just hides all of the wires that are coming out from the block. So definitely recommend both of them. If you watch my vlogs, then you know we recently redid our half bath powder room and it is simple. The entire thing used to be pale yellow. I'm talking toilet, sink, blinds, tiles on the floor, tiles on the wall, everything was pale yellow. So. When we finally redid it, I wanted to keep it super clean because that is the bathroom our guests are using and it's kind of a central location in the house. I really wanted to have a tissue box in there. That's the only thing besides soap I have in there. And normally a tissue box would be fine. It really would, but my dumbass picked out the Toy Story tissue boxes like a year ago. And because it's just my husband and I, we have a ton left. So this tissue box cover was essential. It's just a really thin leather square. You can get it in a rectangle, you can get it in this square. It comes in a bunch of colors. So this matches with the bathroom. Again, I just wanted everything super clean and I know I'll be able to put this on any tissue box that I put in there. So for $13, this was a must have in our new bathroom. This is going to be another TikTok find and I'm sure you've seen it if you're on TikTok, but labeling spice containers. So the actual containers are going to be featured in my next Amazon video because they were over $20. It came with a ton of them. You will understand why it was over $20, but the actual labels were only $9. 95 so less than $10 and I received 140 of these labels 
absolutely mind-blowing like can't beat it they're nice, bright, white, big. I love how much space they take up. So this was a really easy project to do and just cleaned up that area. We had all of our spices in a pull drawer and I had to take individual ones out to check what the labels were. So now that these are just laying down in a drawer, it's so much easier to find what I'm looking for if I'm making dinner quickly, baking, the whole nine yards. So. Highly recommend organizing your spices. Before I picked up those spice containers, I purchased these glass jars first. So they did come with other labels, didn't love them. So I placed the label I just showed you on my glass jars as well. So these glass jars came with 12. So they're six ounces, came with 12, and I use them for my big spices. So the spices that I buy in the bigger containers, like my chili powder, onion salt, garlic powder, all of that stuff. I keep a salt and pepper one on our counter with our oil and balsamic as well for cooking. It's just so much easier to pinch and go. Plus your kitchen looks aesthetic as all hell. I talked so much shit about this cup five months ago in my last Amazon video and I stand by what I said. So there's still perspiration all over the cup, but I would be an asshole if I didn't talk about it because I do use it every other day, at least twice a week. I just run through my cups and when the other ones are dirty, I grab this one and I don't mind. I'm working from home. I'll put more ice in it. It's really not a big deal. This comes in dozens of colors. It doesn't look bad. It's glass. It's bamboo. You have the plastic straw. And it was only $16. So if you're just looking for a nice cup to keep your water in, like I'm chugging water lately, I just put it in this with some Mio and it works. I went a little cuckoo when I did go on an organizing kick and I needed to do my refrigerator, my drawers, my spices, my cabinet, literally everything, the bathroom and the bedroom. And I did it to my husband, I did it to my stuff. Every time I ask my husband to put his clothes away, he swears he doesn't have enough room. So I got these little organizers so he can see every pair of socks, underwear, like everything. And I did it for myself too. So. These I use for my swimsuits, my socks, my underwear, my sports bras, my sleeping bras. I love them. Leave a comment if you're sick of me mentioning TikTok. So we have two bookshelves in our living room and no books in the bookshelves. So I saw a TikTok that you can buy used books fairly cheap on Amazon and that's exactly what I did. So because these were used, I believe all three were under $15 and our living room is super neutral our bookshelves are completely white so i wanted to keep the books neutral and white as well so i really didn't care what the contents were but i actually like these books these would be great coffee table books too shelves bookshelves so the first one is beautifully organized i'm a psycho i love organizing and then the next two are two art books i'm not even going to pretend to know how to say that um and de Goss. you just have to be careful with used books because they usually make you pay for shipping then it ends up being more than twenty dollars and we don't like that another way we got organized was by me purchasing a cap like a hat no not like a hat storage bin container for my husband's hats so they used to all be hung behind the guest bedroom door and there were so many hats there that the door never fully shut and it just annoyed the hell out of me. I like doors open and bright lights, bright natural light. So I bought this clear container and it fit all of his hats and he has to own over 20 hats. So for $9 organizing that space, having the door open, he can see all of them because the container is clear. It was just an absolute no brainer. You cannot go on Pinterest and look up a living room without seeing one of these. Like <laughs> they are everywhere. These wood beads and like tassels. I don't know. They're everywhere. I recently painted the back of our bookshelf. It used to be this like weird light blue and I made it all white. So I've been slowly getting rid of all of our blue decor and integrating some neutrals. For 10 bucks, I mean, you really can't go wrong. Furniture stores definitely sell these for way more than $10, but to put on a bookshelf and never think about it again, can't go wrong for 10 bucks. That's going to be it for part one of this new Amazon series. Thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel to make sure you are here for part two.